when one is in an exalted state or in a depressed mood that certain hormonal or chemical changes take place in the brain, endocrine organs, peripheral organs and tissues and that in turn causes the disease to progress or to be improved. So when you collect the evidence for this where you study someone that might have a gift say for so-called healing what goes on in their brain what goes on in their bloodstream and every other part of their body study it all we might get some clues to how these things come about Berthold Schwartz is a Dartmouth educated psychiatrist who along with his regular practice has studied mind-body phenomena for years in his Vero Beach Florida office one of his subjects is Joey Newsom a man with the ability to focus his mental energies to create fire. Schwartz has recorded Joey's experiments on videotape and in 12 volumes of notes. Joey Newsom is one of the most remarkable gentlemen I ever met for psychic abilities. Joey's entranced and zapping the tissue on the plastic plate which rests on a wooden table. Spontaneous combustion. No ash, no visible evidence for what once was. What happened to it? How did it vanish? What was the mechanism between Joey and the tissue, the matter? Joey learned of his skills at an early age when he was given the chore of bringing newspapers out to his family's burn barrel. That's when I became fascinated with fire. The bag of you know, papers and stuff that was being thrown away into the burn barrel and then just stared at it and, and, and focused on it and until it just burst into flames. Growing up, Joey had a difficult time at both school and home. He concentrated on developing his skills as a way of channeling his frustration and energies. Watching him, the intensity of his focus is apparent as he puts himself into a trance-like state. In this experiment, his goal is to gather negative energies into the water in his glass and, through spontaneous combustion, rid them from his life. There was negative elements I was um, magnetizing to the water and bringing it into the bowl to banish it. The negative elements escaped the bowl and proceeded to catch the table on fire. But I was able to still control it because I stayed pretty well focused and, and was able to banish it from, you know, from, from where it was trying to escape. Dr. Schwartz hopes one day medical scientists will take notice of his work and study people like Joey Newsom to help find answers about the link between fire and the body. Joey Newsom, or someone like him, could be a treasured scientific or national asset. He pay off great dividends from man's philosophical, spiritual outlook, from the narrow medical point of view. You name it, it's all out there. Starting fires with mental energies seems especially far-fetched for most people in the medical and science worlds to consider. However, the idea of spontaneous human combustion is becoming more interesting to chemists. It is a well-known scientific fact that when some chemicals are mixed together, a reaction occurs which creates fire.